Close your eyes and watch your breath. Watch it all the way in, all the way out. Notice how the breathing feels. If this breath doesn't feel comfortable, well, you've got the next chance with the next breath. You can change it, make it longer, shorter, faster, slower. Lots of different ways you can adjust the breath. And if this breath doesn't work out, there's always the next one. This is a good principle to keep in mind. It's not the case that you want someone to take a record of your past breaths and be proud of the fact that you had a perfect breath five minutes ago. You always want to be learning from the next one and the next one. The type of people who have already have to be perfect, those are the ones who never learn anything. This is why the Buddha said if you want to become self-reliant, part of it is learning how to take criticism well. Because we learn from our mistakes, and if we don't admit our mistakes, it means we have no teachers, nothing to learn from. And ideally, we should learn from our own mistakes, observing them ourselves. But there's a lot we can't see. It's like looking at your face. You can't see your mouth, you can't see your eyes, you can't see your eyebrows. You have to look in a mirror, and only when you look in the mirror can you see them. The same way some of the mistakes you make as you go through life are things that other people see you can't see. Which is why the Buddha said it's wise to learn how to take criticism well. Whether it's good criticism or useless criticism, always be polite when people criticize you. That way, if someone has something of real value to tell you, they'll be willing to tell you. If you show yourself as the kind of person who doesn't take criticism well, people will stop offering you advice. And part of you may like that, but then there's a large part of you that's not going to learn anything. So for your own good, learn how to take criticism well. As the Buddha said, be someone who's easy to teach. Now, you can take the teachings and do with them as you decide. But if you show yourself to be the sort of person who doesn't like to take criticism, then the opportunity for good things just won't come. That way you never get to see your mouth, you never get to see your eyebrows. See if there's anything wrong there. You need the mirror of other people in order to see yourself from all around.